Hey folks, we're at osmvtextures.com. You're watching our unboxing slash video first look of the Apple iPad Smart Cover. This is the original model that was released, and it comes, of course, in different color iterations, such as the silver version, also the black, the blue, and um, several other variations. You can purchase directly from Apple, from Best Buy, from Amazon.com, and it retails for a price of around $50 or so. So as far as cases go, um, it isn't too expensive, but at the same time, for only really a cover, it is uh, more expensive and more premium, um, being an official Apple-licensed product. Um, again, this, this isn't going to protect, protect your entire iPad. Of course, it only covers up the screen, so it protects it from smudges and scratches. But the main thing here is the smart cover, so it has a magnetic um, hinge on the side, so it automatically clips onto your iPad without the need for any screws or um, anything mechanical like that. And after you lift off the cover from the screen, the iPad screen will automatically turn on, and when you, when you put it back, it's going to automatically turn off, um, again, due to magnets on the right-hand edge of the iPad. So it's got a few sensors in here that are specifically designed to be used with your iPad. It also dubs as a stand for either typing, as you can see here on the back, or for video chatting with the uh, video camera being propped up as a stand for watching movies and entertainment and the such. So it's a very strongly designed product with a lot of unique features, very simplistic, but also a tad expensive for really just being a few pieces of magnets um, and a velvet case instead of being something that protects your device all the way through. But again, as an Apple product, it's uh, packaged extremely well and it's pretty beautiful. You can find it for a street price of around $30 or so online. So again, it's just some basic information on the top, an Apple logo, aluminum hinge, uh, wake your iPad, choose from a vibrant polyurethane or rich, or rich leather as well. If the leather versions are a little bit more expensive, again, we have just the regular um, plastic material here, different colors, also has a microfiber cleaning, lining that cleans your device uh, device's screen from smudges when it is being closed, which is also pretty nice. Again, Apple compatible, and uh, essentially that's it. To open up the casing, we just have a tab here which we can lift up, hopefully. There we go. It's stuck on there pretty tight, actually. And lift up, and now we just basically open it up, I guess. Essentially, it's all I need to do, but press it inwards. And now the case is out of the device. Um, and then this is uh, some instructions for telling you how to recycle the packaging, how to put the unit onto your iPad, as you can see here, and how to close it up. Um, and some basic, simplistic instructions. I believe there's probably a one-year warranty on this product. I need to check. This basically slides out, as you can see from the arrow here. So pretty tightly designed packaging. And essentially that's it. I don't believe there are any other instructions. It's just a piece of paper here. And that's essentially it, as far as packaging is concerned. Um, here is the slide out, which, let's see how we get out of this. It's just a sticker on there, picked out off the side. And here is the actual smart cover. Um, again, it has a nice microfiber cleaning um, design on the back. It's a pretty thin piece of actual material, so it's pretty lightweight, but seems rather durable as well. Um, when I'm closing it up, it doesn't look like it's going to break or fry. And again, the hinge here is really indeed um, aluminum. It has a nice detailing and quality to it, and it says designed in, by Apple in California. Even though it's small, it seems like it's going to last a pretty long time. Um, the magnets are pretty strong in here, so I'm not too worried about it falling off or you know reducing its magnetivity over time. And the back is a little bit more rubbery and textured, which is nice as well. Again, it folds up for multiple shapes, like uh, for propping it up to different stands positions, like the such. And it seems like it actually will work pretty fairly well. It might fall off a bit the first few times, but it should stand over time. And looks like a pretty quality case. We're going to get back with a full review and, of course, a written article on our website. So if you're interested, thanks for watching. This has been an unboxing slash video first look of the iPad Smart Cover.